5 million heartbeats a year is what Evan Melcher, a 48-year-old financial advisor outside of Atlanta, Georgia, saved because he stopped drinking alcohol. His resting heart rate dropped and he saved 5 million heartbeats a year. And you will save something similar in terms of heartbeats a year when you also stop drinking. I am James Swanick. I'm going to show you how we helped Evan to stop drinking and just completely transform his health, including saving his drowning three-year-old son. More on that in a second. I'll let Evan share that story with you. But Evan was on prescription drugs for years, anti-anxiety medication, acid reflux medication. I'm gonna show you, or he's gonna share with you how he got off prescription medication and he's 20 pounds lighter and he's just loving life. He's gonna share with you what his drinking was like and now he's alcohol free how his life has changed. But first of all, just a little bit about me before I let Evan introduce himself to you. Uh, I am the founder of Alcohol Free Lifestyle. We help business owners, executives, um, affluent, rich, wealthy, high net worth, financially comfortable, successful people to stop drinking without having to go to AA, without having to go to rehab, without relying on this brute willpower. You've probably successfully stopped drinking for a time, but you realize that long-term, whatever strategies you're using are unsuccessful, they're ineffective. Yeah, you can do Sober October, you can do Dry January, you can do a 30-day challenge, you can read a book, you can listen to a podcast, and you can stop for a while, but then the slippery slope gets you and you go back to drinking. If you are stressed, anxious, not sleeping well, you're in pain, you uh, have marital stress, you're not present with your children, you're 20, 30 pounds overweight, you've got acid reflux, your cholesterol's high, you need to reverse your health, comp uh, health challenges. That's who we support. Let me share my screen. I'll just show you a little bit about uh, us quickly. Um, here is a photo of me and the Hollywood uh, Starlet Jennifer Aniston, you can see there, I'm pretty chubby, don't look so great. Um, the Daily Mail did a story about me and my transformation. I lost 30 something pounds. Uh, I was stressed, anxious, irritable, um, bad relationships, financial mediocrity, and then I stopped drinking and um, just everything changed in my life. Just, you know, feel terrific. We've been featured in some press, GQ, Psychology Today, Forbes magazine, Fast Company, um, you may have seen me. I was a sports center anchor on ESPN uh, for a while. And I got that job about two months after I stopped drinking alcohol. And I credit not drinking alcohol to helping me get that job. And the University of Washington, the University of Florida did a joint scientific study on our stop drinking method um, in first quarter of 2023. And the results are published 2024. But they told us that the professor, I should say, whose name is um, Christopher Barnes, this is him here, told me that there was a 98% reduction in the uh, test group. So we had two groups. We had a, a treatment group, people who were going through our method for helping people stop drinking. And then there was a weight group of people who weren't going through our method. And there was a 98% reduction in folks who went through our method. Um, uh, results published first or second quarter 2024. Okay, so that's a little bit about us. So let me now have Evan Melcher um, explain a little bit more about him. He is um, you know, just a wonderful guy, but was in a bad state when he was drinking. And uh, I mentioned about saving his uh, three-year-old son from drowning. Let me have him share the story with you. We had an incident where my youngest son, Ezra, was he had just turned three and he actually drowned in a pool uh, at a neighbor's house. And we were we were there, my wife and I were there. Um, another couple was there and, um, thankfully we got him out and had to perform CPR and after a couple minutes got him back and he did spend time in the hospital recovering from that. And thank God he's totally fine. He's, he just turned five and he just started kindergarten. He's great. You know, but I think back upon that incident and it was definitely the exception that we were not drinking that day. Typically, mm -hmm. we we would, you know, go and have a couple beers and and hang out and, you know, thankfully for whatever reason, I decided mm -hmm. not to drink that day mm -hmm. and was able to perform CPR and and get him back. But you know, you think back to those incidents and you think, oh my goodness, what would have happened? What could have happened mm -hmm. if the adults there were impaired and couldn't? Mm -hmm you know, perform that miracle. Incredible story. What danger are you putting yourself in with your drinking? What danger are you putting your loved ones in by your drinking? It might not be death, life and death, 
like it was with Evan with his son. It was literally life and death. But is it your marriage? Are you putting your marriage under threat? Your relationship with your children, your job, your career, your business? How much money are you leaving on the table because you're operating at a three or a four out of 10 and not a seven, eight, nine out of 10 each day? It could be millions of dollars. Like literally your drinking could be costing you millions of dollars because you're irritable and you're stressed and you're, you're anxious and you're not putting in the best that you can do. And so maybe your business is in danger. Your marriage is in danger. Your relationship with your children is in danger. Your life is in danger because of all these health complications because of your drinking. Drinking. And I know this sounds like tough love because I'm screaming down the the, uh, the screen here at you, but like it's time to wake up. And if you're in pain because of your drinking and you've tried to stop or you've successfully stopped, but you're on that stop start cycle, it's time to try something different. So I really want to show you how we helped Evan or have Evan share with you how we helped him. All right, so 2020, your drinking probably increased during the pandemic, right, as it did for many people. And, uh, you know, here's what Evan said about it. 2020 was tough, right? Everybody had the pandemic and everybody mm -hmm. faced that. Um, and it obviously impacted different people in different ways. So I would consider that to be one of kind of the whammies that hit us as a family. Mm -hmm. Joining Project 90 was a great way for me to you know, be 100% focused. You know, it was also coming at a time where we were coming out of the pandemic. And um, I think uh, along with a lot of other people, you know, maybe one glass of wine a night turned into two and, you know, one extra pound here or there turned into 20. And so, you know, the desire to just, you know, be healthier, um, mm -hmm. I think also felt really good for me. So yeah, you heard Evan reference um, joining Project 90. Project 90 is our 90 day stop drinking process, just for context. Also, you probably hear a woman um, agreeing in the background here. That's one of our uh, top coaches uh, educated at uh, Yale University, addiction coaches. Her name is Victoria English. I'll tell you a little bit more about her in a second. But yeah, this, um, when you hear the woman's voice, you see the woman, that's Victoria English, our top coach. So uh, Evan was addicted to medication and uh, let me just have him share a little bit more about that. Yeah, over a decade of anti-anxiety medication, acid reflux prescription medication, I was doing frequent um, endoscopies to make sure, you know, just to kind of check on how that acid was impacting my um, my stomach and my esophagus. And it was just, it was just not on a good trend. And being, you know, someone in their early to mid forties and being mm -hmm. on this medication, some of that medication becomes lifelong medication and, and has other detrimental effects as well. Mm -hmm. And so I had tried over the years to stop um, the different medications and I would always kind of have these rebounds. It didn't really, which medication it was, I always had a rebound of some kind and wasn't able to kind of break that cycle. This is where Evan had a choice to make. He could have kept going with willpower, trying to do it, read a book, go to AA rehab, or he could try something different. And you probably feel like you have a choice to make as well. Like you can keep trying your ineffective strategy of white knuckling it, trying to do it on your own, or you can choose something different. Evan chose something different. Here he is telling you about it. I, I was able to wean myself off of the different medications as I went through the Project 90. And then at the end of Project 90, I went to my doctor and had a recheck. And so I'm really religious about my annual physical in January every year. Yeah. And every year I go back and get tested and I have to stay on the medications. And mm -hmm. so I went back for kind of a mid-year check after Project 90 and I had dropped off the medication. And the doctor was blown away. I mean... Just because my cholesterol fell to a level that was below where it was when I was on the statins, I was no longer taking my, I was no longer having to take my anti-anxiety medication and mm -hmm. felt more, you know, kind of balanced, and even, um, and then my acid reflux was gone. So my resting heart rate dropped by over 10 beats a minute, I mean, which is f over 5 million heartbeats a year. Yes. <laughs> which is incredible. Um, so my heart thanks me and thanks you <laughs> for leading me through the program. But, um, you know, I've gone from sleep scores that were average to mm -hmm. low to well above average or optimal. Um, so that's been incredible. And like I mentioned, some of the other metrics like cholesterol and things like that, that just have blown my physician away. I went to the doctor the other day. I went to the dermatologist, right? And you fill mm -hmm. out all the, you know, the, the little forms 
And one of the things I used to feel so guilty about was going to the doctor and you fill out all those forms when you get there. And it says, mm-hmm. how many alcoholic drinks do you consume a week? And, you know, you used to put two, four, whatever the numbers. <laughs> <Right. laughs> the number was, and you feel guilty about it, right? Because yes. you know you're not telling the truth. Mm-hmm. And um, But to put zero and to just... I, I you almost wait for someone to question me, like to say, really zero, right? <laughs> Is it really zero? Too. Isn't that great? <laughs> yeah, but it feels so good. Incredible health transformation there. I'm sure you would agree. Is your resting heart rate up? Is your cholesterol up? Are you carrying unwanted body fat? Are you not sleeping well? Are you irritable, stressed? If that is you, it doesn't have to be this way. Do something different than what you've been doing, just like Evan chose. And You know, it's a powerful thing to be in a group where you've got Yale and Harvard educated coaches and you have um, a a like-minded community of people who are supporting you. And, you know, the results when you do that are astounding. And relationships in Evan's life also improved. Here's what he had to say about that. My relationship with my kids and my wife has never been better. I remember being in our program and having our calls and having, I remember, I won't say his name, but I remember one of our more senior members Mm -hmm. saying, wow, if I could have gone back in time and stopped when I was in my 40s instead of in my 60s, yes, the difference that that could have made in the relationships that I had and the the example that I set for my for my kids mm-hmm. is mind blowing. And what a gift to be able to do that in your forties with young young kids at home. And I just that really stuck with me. Most of what this member said stuck with me, but uh, but yeah, that in particular stuck with me. And I just mm-hmm. think to myself, man, you know, I'm never going to get everything right, but this is one thing I feel like I'm on the right side of when it comes to raising my kids. If you're ready for professional support to go through the exact same process and method that Evan went through, there's a link down below where you can click on that and schedule a call with us. You'll just go to a page, you'll um, type in your name, your number, um, and then answer a few questions, and then you'll book a call and we'll actually phone you and we can walk you through the same process that we walked Evan through. Just to be clear, that phone call will just be a 20 minute exploratory call. There'll be nothing for you to buy and we'll have nothing to sell you. If you're feeling it and we're feeling it and it feels like it's worthy of a lengthier conversation to see how we could support you and maybe you could potentially become a client of ours, then we will schedule another call after that. But for now, if you want to just have a 20 minute conversation, if you are in pain, if you need to do something, if you're a business owner, you're you're wealthy, affluent, that's the the, the community we support, then I invite you to click on that button and um, schedule a call. Let me just share my screen a little bit more and I'll tell you just a little bit more about who we are and what we do. Um, and I'll show you who our coaches are. Let me just share my screen. So this is, um, I referenced Victoria English before. She's one of our top coaches. This is Sarah Connolly. Um, both uh, of them were educated um, at Yale University and University of Cambridge. So we are, um, you know, we're neuroscience-based coaches. We understand um, the neuroscience and that's effective. We don't do AA, surrendering to a higher power, We don't do rehab, lamenting the past, everything's all shame-based. What we do is we provide an aspirational, simple and fun methodology. Uh, It's all virtual. You can do it from home, your car. um, We provide daily training videos, live video coaching calls, text message and email support. It's an interactive and positive community. There's um, rigorous monitored accountability. We make sure that you have a determined commitment to your outcome. It might be 90 days alcohol free. It could be losing weight. It could be saving your marriage. And like I said, we're all certified expert coaches, educated at Yale and uh, Harvard and Cambridge. I've got Cambridge there and Yale. Um, Some people who've said some nice things about us. This is Dawn. She says, thanks, James. I'm very grateful to you and your team. You've helped uh, me make a real difference in my life and in my family's life and giving me the tools for ongoing going permanent change and I'm spreading the word. Well, that's nice. We've already gone through that. So how we do it, it's fun, it's aspirational, it's holistic. Um, we get people focused on relationships and leadership, personal responsibility, health and nutrition, goal setting. Here's how we're different just in a more you know, a nicer graph, I guess. It, the, the traditional way, if you go to AA or rehab, it's stigmatized language. We use positive language. You have to believe in a higher power if you're at at AA. We use neuroscience. You're powerless over your addiction in those traditional methodologies. We're like empowering you. Like no one's powerlessness. You're powerful. Uh, You get to create how life goes. No more lamenting the past. 
Now we're creating a future. We're not moving away from the pain. We're moving towards pleasure and ease and pride and feeling amazing. You have to go in person if you're going to AA or rehab. Here it's all virtual, right? Limited access to support because it's only when you're there in person. For us, 24 hour, seven day support. So that gives you a little bit of context about what we do and how we do it. Um, we do Zoom calls. We make like six Zoom calls available a week. Clients only need to be on one of them um, per week as a requirement, but you can be in on, on as many as you want. Let me just show you what it looks like. This is an example of a Zoom call. You can see there um, all these people agreed to have their image shared with you. Many of them don't. It's private and confidential. No one's going to know you're doing it. It's not a public facing thing. The only people who talk publicly about it are those who want to share their story, just like Evan has shared his story. We have a um, Marco Polo group where people will send little video messages to each other, other clients. These are other business owners, executives, physicians, investors. In fact, I have a slide here of the type of clients that we support. Here are some of the, the clients. Um, Business owners, executives, investors, physicians, attorneys, doctors, vascular surgeons, financial advisors, salesmen, dentists. These are some of the actual job titles of um, some of our most recent clients. You can see here we have a professional civil engineering manager, a psychologist, a water damage restoration and construction company owner, early stage venture investor, retired private investor, marketing executive, insurance company, VP, finance, healthcare consulting company, a radiologist, a realtor, real estate broker, plumbing company owner, mortgage industry branch, healthcare software, billboard sign company owner. Um, so that gives you an idea of the type of clientele we have. Um, candidly, I'm just going to tell you straight up, our program costs thousands of dollars. So if you're looking for a fun little challenge, it's hundreds of dollars, or you want to go and do dry January or sober October again, we're not for you. Um, our program costs thousands of dollars and you want it to cost thousands of dollars because that's what gives you the accountability. You get coaching, accountability, um, aspirational, and you have that skin in the game, right? The skin in the game is like you're investing in yourself. So there's no retreat. It's like kind of like burning the ships. You know, you, you burn the ships, there is no retreat. That's what it is. That's why, uh, that's why our clientele are made up of affluent, financially comfortable, people, higher net worth people, well-educated, um, because there's a power that comes in being in a like-minded community. There's a book actually, a New York Times bestselling book called The Power of Habit by Charles C. Duhigg. And he says that change becomes probable when you're in a like-minded community with a common goal. So if you were in a group of people that included a 19-year-old meth addict who's holding up gas stations with a gun or a knife, are you really going to be able to relate to that person? You may have been to AA before and just gone, I don't really to any of these people like what the heck are they talking about like I, i'm so different and maybe going to aa kind of feels like this let me share the screen maybe it feels a bit like hi my name is and see how this guy's looking down and you don't really relate to these people in fact these are the really ineffective ways of, of trying to, to handle your drinking aa reported less than 7% success rate. Treatment centers reported less than 5%. Willpower, trying to do it on your own, completely ineffective. Why do you keep trying? Motivation on its own, really ineffective. And then trying to do moderation, which is, you know, like, look, you can do moderation after you've gone 90 days alcohol free with us and we've rewired your mindset. But if you're trying to do moderation, you know that you will like won't drink on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, but then you'll drink Thursday, Friday, Saturday. You'll say you won't drink Monday through Friday, but then you'll drink on Saturday and Sunday. You know how this goes. So I want to ask you to like kind of like wake up to yourself and realize that you are wasting years, decades in many cases. And I get that you feel resistant around not drinking. And by the way, we don't promise that we don't ask you to say that you're never going to drink again. We just ask you to promise that you're going to not drink for 90 days using our process. Because at most people, when they get to 90 days, they just say, I love this. I want to keep going. Um, so yeah, just to go over those ineffective ways again, and then I'll come back to Evan. And by the way, just before I do that, reminder, schedule a call down below, click on the link, um, schedule a call will phone you. Again, nothing to buy on that first call, just an exploratory conversation with one of our coaches to see if you would be a good fit and if you feel we might be a good fit for you. If you're not in pain, if you want to do a fun little challenge, if you just, if you still not persuaded you need to stop drinking, don't book the call. Do not book the call, please. Likewise, if you don't have thousands of dollars to invest in yourself, don't book the call. We're not for you. Like people go, oh, but you're, you should be helping people. Listen, 98% of 
my coaching is for free all over the internet. Just Google James Swanick and you will see I've done 200 podcasts where I've outlined the process that we take our clients through. Um, I've done newspaper articles. I've done free coaching calls. It's all over the internet. You can read my free guide. I've got a free book there. You can just go to our website and get the free book. It's free, 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 free. But guess what? Free is not going to get you the outcome that you want. And for those who want the additional support, the paid support, like the, the accountability that comes from investing in yourself and having skin in the game, that is where people get the result. And if you are losing millions of dollars or tens of thousands of dollars, hundreds of thousands of dollars because you're not clear and because you're irritable and you're stressed and you, you, you're foggy or you're facing having to hand out millions of dollars or half a million dollars or hundred thousand dollars because you're going to get a divorce. What we charge you is so cheap and so cost effective by comparison. It's not so cheap that you just kind of, like, eh, I don't value it, but it's expensive enough that it holds you accountable. So I really only want people who are ready to lean into that resistance. If that's you book a call and we'll call you. If it's not, please don't waste your time. Don't waste hours by booking a call. I know this sounds a bit harsh, but you know, I, I've been doing this since 2015 and I can't tell you how many people are like, I really, want to, I really want to do it. And then they get stuck on what they have to pay to do it. And then they go, they get stuck for years and years, sometimes decades. Um, maybe let's go back to Evan and he can tell you a little bit more. Um, Evan was nervous in the beginning, right? He was nervous. He was watching a video like this is now. And, uh, you know, he was worried about what other people were going to think. Let's go to Evan and I'll let him share with you how he felt. The thing I was most nervous about when I when I joined Project 90, I remember in the first couple of weeks, I was so kind of, I felt ashamed. So I didn't want anybody to know that I was doing it. Mm -hmm, um, I remember. <laughs> and I remember thinking, okay, I need help preparing. We're going to a dinner date, you know, with, with friends and we always have good food and we have good wine. And so we're going to show up and I'm going to say I'm doing this 90 day break. And how do I just say that I'm not drinking without mm -hmm. it seeming like I have a problem or I have an issue. Mm -hmm. And I felt so much, um, you know, shame around that and, and trepidation. And it's just totally flipped. Um, and I've gotten to a place where when I say that I'm not drinking or I'm good, I'm proud of it now. You know, I kind of want to yeah. sing it from the mountaintops without being kind of preachy, right? Like this of is course. for me and it's a decision that's that's right for me. But I, I do find myself a year ago, I felt that I was um, afraid to make that mm. pronouncement. And now I feel very proud when I make that pronouncement if someone asks me. And so it's just, it's just amazing how your whole mentality shifts when you, mm -hmm. when you realize that, you know, most people are drinking at the table at dinner or at that work event or whatever. If you're that one or two people that aren't drinking and you are a hundred percent present and cognizant and taking it all in and not mm -hmm. numbing out. You know, I was looking for an accountability group when I wanted to do this. And so that's mm -hmm. how I found project 90. I was looking around and researching different groups. And that's one of the things that resonated with me about your program mm -hmm. versus a lot of others. You know, a lot of others were focused on being an alcoholic and how mm -hmm. do you know that you're an alcoholic and what do you right? And I did not feel like I was an alcoholic. Um, my wife did not feel like I was an alcoholic. I was not in, you know, I didn't hit rock bottom. That's what resonated with me about this program. Mm -hmm. It wasn't, you know, that I felt like I was an alcoholic. It was just, yeah. I felt like I wanted an accountability group that could help me, you mm -hmm. know, go that 90 days, gain the tools and the skills that I felt like I needed so that I could you know, go to those events and do those social outings and those work outings without needing that drinking my, in my hand or the, the glass of red wine every single night. Yes. Um, and it's just through the program. I mean, my, my eyes were opened up and through additional reading and the videos mm -hmm. that you guys have, it just allowed me to kind of see that this was a lifestyle that I wanted to stick with. Right. And I liked my lifestyle better when I, when alcohol wasn't in it anymore yes let me share a few more success stories just a reminder before i do you can click the button down below schedule the call we'll we'll give you a call but here are a few success stories i'm just going to go and show you this gentleman here steve wilt 58 year old from akron ohio financial services manager he said that uh he went through the process and he feels 10 to 20 years younger he sleeps better it's clearer skin lost weight doesn't skip workouts improves he's better tennis player improved marriage that's incredible look at the physical transformation 
motivation in Steve. This is Roseanne Forte. She's a retiree. She lost 21 pounds and her blood pressure dropped 20 pounds. Look at the difference there. You can see it. Look, this is before, this is after. So if weight loss is your goal, amongst other things, the, these are, you know, stories that you can see. Now, this is Evan. Like, this is Evan who you just saw. Look at the before and after photo there. Look how he's puffy there and he's not so puffy there. This is Jessica Gaines Jabo, who got better real estate clients. Her hair improved. Her complexion changed. Um, she texted me. She says, James, you are awesome and amazing. Thank you for being um, my vehicle for making a commitment to be alcohol-free. Life is magical and awesome, and it's all been here the whole time. You just popped into my head, and I wanted to say thank you. Hope you're having a wonderful day. Um, this is Steve Aguiar from the city of Livermore in California. He is now three years alcohol free, but he wrote this LinkedIn article, two and a half years without alcohol. He lost 63 pounds, improved his marriage, grew a pumpkin patch, and now he's retiring. And check out this before and after. Look at him here. Damn, big boy. Here, not as big. 63 pounds he lost. Isn't that incredible? Um, here's what Steve texted me. James, before I joined P90, I was nearly 260 pounds, unhealthy and unhappy. Today, I'm 205 pounds, healthier, happier, and good for 100 miles on the bike in a day. I just wanted to share my gratitude for you and my Project 90 family for helping me find my way back to the better version of myself. Love you all. Incredible. Here's Angela Ponsford. Um, she's the uh, mother of two uh, of twin daughters she said uh this is when she posted that she was on 150 days alcohol free never would i have imagined i'd get this far when i first signed up um she's incredible here's john look at the before and after of john wow big puffy face not so puffy he had to get slightly smaller glasses because um his glasses look too big on him compared um uh, when we were looking at it from his previous uh, uh previous weight here's karen I certainly wasn't a skeptic when I joined the program, but I couldn't fathom how life-changing it would be. My brain has been officially rewired and alcohol now sits on a shelf with other poisons that could potentially kill me. Um, this is Heather Kazakoff. She did the 90-day challenge, uh, 90 days um, program with us, I'm sorry. While you can try to do it on your own, this program allows you to connect with a supportive community through daily and weekly connections, access a structured curriculum with tons of resources, and you don't have to go it alone. Joining and completing this program was the best gift I could have ever given myself and to those around me. My physical and mental health have improved significantly, significantly, and my sleep is now glorious. This program helps to rewire the brain and the societal conditioning that we have been born into around alcohol. I'm so grateful for James, the coaches in the program. I could never have imagined feeling so good. I love that kind of stuff. Um, so I'll also share another thing with you in, in just a second, but uh, I'll let Evan just share again here. Oh, actually, what I should show you is um, uh, a LinkedIn article that Evan actually wrote about his time. And I'll show you, Evan wrote a LinkedIn article, which has been viewed hundreds of times. Let me just share my screen. Here's Evan, 365 days off alcohol, how my life changed and what I learned. And you can see here, he mentioned mentions Project 90, mentions me, mentions Victoria English. And uh, let's have a look down. 578 likes and shares and 113 comments. And all these people saying inspiring, amazing. And these are all business owners, executives, all the type of people who are um, our clients. And then I think somewhere I have a photo of uh, when I met up with Evan recently in London, sharing the screen. This is not a super fancy production. I, I appreciate that, but let me have a look here. So here's Evan, and this is Christian, another client. I was in London recently. Evan flew over to go and watch um, the Atlanta Falcons play an NFL game at Wembley Stadium. He's an Atlanta guy, and Christian um, was one of our clients from 2020, I think. And we all we had a beautiful alcohol-free dinner. See, there's no wine there so that's um evan i think we've got does evan want to say something else before we go let's have a look um yeah let's let, let evan finish up here he, he was talking about how it's been better for, for his clients and community he, he continues to invest in himself it helped me be better which mm -hmm. is obviously helping my clients it's helping my community it's helping my company and if there's five or ten people that also hear that message that get better it, it'll just make you know, all of us better. Continuing to invest in in myself, um, so I think obviously that's important. Just trying to live a life that I'm that I'm proud of. You know, I just don't want to get to the end of this life that I'm living and look back and and have regrets. And so, just trying to kind of maximize 
life, live it to its fullest, um, mm-hmm. help where I can, be an engaged and present dad, um, be a good husband. Thank you for your coaching and for you and James and others, all the other coaches that you know started this program and continue to to offer it and make the world a better place. It's mm-hmm. it's been really incredible. You guys run an amazing community, and the fact that we're all able to stay in touch, kind of post the ninety day program, is yeah. is also really inspiring. It's a real deal. It's <laughs> it's awesome. So thank you. There you go. So is it your turn? Are you ready? Are you ready to invest financially in yourself, invest time? Are you ready uh, to stop the stop, start vicious cycle? If so, you know what to do. Fill in the details, click the link, we'll talk to you. We use neuroscience, you know, we're not 12 steps. You can do this. I know the, the idea of stopping drinking forever feels really overwhelming. That's why we don't have you promise that you're not gonna drink again. We just have you promise that you're gonna drink for 90 days, at least 90 days, and then we'll see where you're at. Let me just share my screen one last time. We use neuroscience. We also bring in guest um, coaches like James Clear, who sold, I think, 15 million copies of Atomic Habits. Um, Ryan Holiday, Obstacle is the Way. John Gray, who wrote the book, Men Are From Mars, Women Are From Venus. This is John Gray on a group coaching call with our clients. Here's Ryan Holiday, Obstacle is the Way. Like James Clear, Ryan Holiday, John Gray, all the training that they provided are in the training videos that you're going to receive. Michael Bruce is the world's top sleep doctor. Michael Bruce, the power of when, here's Michael Bruce talking to our clients. You get access to all of these amazing coaches. Robert Green, who wrote the 48 lap uh, laws of power, did a training video. Here's what the training videos look like, right? 90 pre-recorded training videos. We tell you what to expect. Um, we have uh, videos of talks um, about how to improve your mindset. Is there an alcohol gene? The science of addiction, dopamine's role. Um, we also do an annual live event, which which when you become a client, you're welcome to attend. We did one in Medellin, Colombia, 2023, Austin, Texas, 2022, Venice Beach, 2019. And then uh, if you um, book a call before this presentation ends and you do so in the next 20 minutes, and we do know exactly when you do it, it's it's got this fancy tech software then you have the ability to go into what uh, beyond 90 program, which happens after 90 days. So a lot of people ask, well, what happens at the end of 90 days? And so, well, people can go into our beyond 90 program. And our beyond 90 program is nine additional months of coaching and community and fun and personal development. And if you schedule in the next 20 minutes from this part of the presentation, which is now, and we know because the clock's on and we've got fancy tech. If you book a call, fill out the application, book the call, you will get completely free access to beyond 90. Okay, that's nine additional months. But if you don't book it now and you'd come back later and blah, 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 and then you book, you don't get the nine months of Beyond 90. You have to pay for it. So I, I am bribing you or I'm trying to incentivize you is probably a better way um, of saying it to get you to take action. Because if you don't take action, what are you going to do? Just stay in the norm? Just keep meandering along, drifting? There's a book by Napoleon Hill who wrote... Um, Think and Grow Rich. He also wrote a book called The uh, Outwitting the Devil. And he says that drifting, just meandering along drifting, kills people's dreams, just kills them. And you may feel like you've been drifting along. And if that's you, you feel like you've been drifting along, wake up, break the cycle, take action. What do you got to lose? Just because you booked this call and you talked to us for 20 minutes doesn't mean that we're going to invite you to be a client. Doesn't mean you have to be a client. There's nothing to buy on that call, that initial call. There'll be something to buy for you after that call if you're feeling it and we're feeling it. And it's going to be thousands of dollars. Yeah, it is. Guess what? It's a lot cheaper than the cost of drinking and regret and being mediocre in your business and your marriage and your health and your mindset. So we're a fun and aspiring group of people. And the the, the folks who go through it and get the results certainly feel that that way. I mean, they've got lived experience from being with us, right? Um, people like Rainy Norris, look at the difference. People like Tom Speed. And by the way, a lot of people think, oh, well, I'm not gonna be able to, what happens after the 90 days? Well, look at, look at all these people here who are 18 months alcohol free, Tom Speed, day 100, day 748 from Mike. Patty Myers, look, I'm looking forward to hitting my two year alcohol free date. Mike, I'll be two years alcohol free on Mar- March the 12th. Steven, I'll hit two years alcohol free at the end of April. Jessica, three years on March the 4th, doing great, love my life, best thing I ever did. Alcohol doesn't even phase me anymore. Like these are, this is the lived experience, the lived experience of our clients. Don't think that I'm trying to sell you. Like let 
our clients help you to sell yourself. And so I just invite you, like if you're looking for something different, if what you've been trying hasn't worked, you're sick of the stop start cycle and you want to get results like Steve Wilt, like Roseanne Forte, like Evren Melcher, like Jessica Gaines Jabo, like Steve Aguiar, like Angela Ponsford, like John Keltner. And by the way, they've all given me permission to use their names. Karen Grundhofer, Heather Kazakoff. Look at all these names of all these people who've got all these amazing results. Rainy Norris, Tom Speed and so forth. Then I invite you to speak with us. Can't do it for you. I can just encourage you to, to try to persuade yourself. Uh, we'll take good care of you. We'll lovingly guide you. We'll give you tough love if or when appropriate. And uh you know, the proof is in the pudding. University of Washington, scientific study, 98% success rate. All these clients thrilled with how their life has changed. Evan Melcher, who you heard from. I mean, I could go on and on and on. Some people say you shouldn't do a one hour long video of these kind of things. But if you're still watching me and we're about 40 minutes in, maybe 45 minutes in, then you're watching for a reason. What is that reason? Well, you know, I don't know what it is, but I would guess or I would submit that you're wanting something different. You're wanting to change. Your health is going in the wrong direction. You've got financial mediocrity. You're not reaching your goals. Um, happiness level, your happiness level's down. Have a poor mindset. And I'll tell you, the biggest resistance that you'll walk into, if you're still watching and you haven't booked the call, by the way, there's only probably about 10 minutes left before we take away that Beyond 90 um, gift, nine additional months of coaching for free. So you best do it. Um, biggest resistance from people is Oh, I shouldn't have to pay to do this. I should just be able to do it for free. Oh, if I have to pay, then I must be really broken. Here's not my tough love response to that. Get over yourself. No Olympian ever went to the Olympics without a coach. We're offering you coaching. Michael Jordan had a, uh, a team coach, a fitness coach, Tim Grover, um, uh, who, who's out on the internet all over the place. Um, a mindset coach and he had a conditioning coach in addition to, to Tim Grover. It was good enough, for Michael Jordan, but you're trying to argue that it's not good enough for you or that you're too good to have a coach? No, get a coach. We are coaches, Yale and Harvard educated. We're very good at what we do and we help our clients achieve what they want. Other, other biggest resistance that people have is like the idea of never drinking again is so overwhelming that they love alcohol so much and this the idea without it is so overwhelming that they can't fathom it so they don't take that initial step. I get it, like I get that feeling. But that's the feeling that you have right before you take the action of enrolling in this program and getting the support and then after a very short time it starts to feel amazing and we are professionals at rewiring your mindset you can do this without it hurting without it being painful right you can we, we present the most simple way of doing this which gets you the result proven results all these people you know with their lived experience are showing you that evan melcher look at the what like he saved his three-year-old son because he wasn't drinking unbelievable closer to his family and friends like i get it feels overwhelming but again we're not asking you to promise that you'll never drink again we're just asking you to promise that you're not going to drink for 90 days with our process and it's going to cost you it's going to cost you money and time and commitment but guess what you're already paying a price and that price is buying alcohol and leaving money on the table, getting a divorce, having stress in your life, you're already paying a price, right? So, you know, what investment do you wanna make? Do you wanna make an investment in yourself and get support in a supportive or aspirational community or do you wanna keep investing in mediocrity and pain and suffering? I've made my choice and all of these folks that I showed you have made their choice and I invite you to make a new choice, one that doesn't involve you suffering because I don't want you to suffer. All right, you're probably sick of hearing me talk. I talk for a while, um, but again, you probably only got Five minutes left now before that free Beyond 90 gets taken away. Book your call now. It's on the screen. I'll let this run for a little bit longer. Thanks for watching. If you're still here, if you're still here, you might be one out of 100 people. And if you are, I acknowledge you for being here. But it doesn't matter that you've been here if you haven't booked that call and taken action. It doesn't matter the decisions you make. It only matters the actions you take. And the action that you can take right now in this moment, if you haven't already done so, click the link and schedule a call. It's not the decisions you make. You can feel really good about the decision. I made the decision, I'm gonna do it. It's not the decisions you make, it's the actions you take. And the action you need to take is book a call and actually be on that damn call. If you book that call and you don't show up and you ghost, you're dead to us. We're not gonna support you, we're not gonna help you, done. You get one shot, like Eminem said, you only get one shot, do not miss your chance to blow because opportunity comes once in a lifetime. Is that how, this, how it goes? I think so. <laughs> anyway, thanks for listening. I acknowledge you for being here. Uh, 
have a great day day and uh maybe we'll get we'll connect inside of our project 90 method and formula and we'll support you to feeling amazing see you for now